Hello everyone, today is Monday the 18th of March and I'm going to LA. Now I'm heading to the airport. I woke up way too early, like around 4 a.m. and I couldn't even feel my body. I was so tired and yes, I mean, I look like a zombie so... I think that's clear. Now I'm in the lunch. I'm waiting for an Uber. I was going to get the liked rail link or something like that, but it's way too early and it's not available yet. So I have decided to get an Uber, which it wasn't that expensive. So I'm waiting for it in the lunch, chilling. I'm just gonna get some water from the machine and start my journey. It's going to be in total around six hours of flight, which is a lot for me, kind of. See you guys in a bit. I will be, of course, filming my journey there so you won't miss anything. And yes, let's start. <laughs> Talking about light winds uh, out of the southeast, temperature about 70 degrees Fahrenheit. I'm waiting for my Uber, I'm getting to my Airbnb and then I'll probably just explore the zone and have fun. Oh god guys, this is like so beautiful. By the way, I haven't introduced you to my new friend. Hello. Carol. Nice yeah, we just met like this morning and when yeah, we're... So we both met because we both missed yeah. bus. And we're kind of like in a similar situation. Like this is our first time traveling alone and we have decided to come to LA. And here we are. It's like we didn't know each other this morning, so... Okay, from 1 to 10, what do you think about this place? <laughs> 1,000. Yeah, does it look real? Like it looks like a painting. Yeah, like all the colors and stuff. Like you have to see it with your own eyes. Like please, you need to come here. And it's so peaceful. I feel like so zen. So yes, I mean, 100% recommended. You need to come here. Now we are heading to the observatory, which is, which is, yeah, which is there. And I think that downtown is right there. Oh no, please focus, focus. <laughs> <laughs> F 
Okay guys, we came here and it's Monday. Guess what? Monday closed. Yeah, we are so lucky. Well, at least we get to enjoy these wonderful views that are breathtaking. Like, oh, oh god. I don't know why, but I'm getting like so emotional because I'm here and stuff, but... Oh my god, I look so terrible, but I'm just gonna finish the vlog because I just remembered that I didn't do it and yes, I just wanted to say a couple of things really quickly so I feel kinda tired and as I said yesterday I didn't sleep and today I filmed a lot and I went to a lot of places and oh god, I, I still can't believe that I'm here like it's something so surreal I know that I always say the same thing like oh I can't believe this I love that, whatever. No, like, this time for real, I, I just, um, I was in the airplane questioning myself, like, do you have always dreamed of coming here and you are doing it? Like, what? And I was almost scared of not being excited for anything else in my life. I know that's, like, super dramatic, but that's how I felt, because if someone last year told me that I was going to go to Los Angeles, I was like, oh, you're kidding me, like, yeah, I'll go definitely someday when I'm, like, 80. But no, it's happening, I'm here, and oh god, Los Angeles is such a pretty place. Place. This is a dream come true and I'm very grateful. There is still a whole week for me just to explore and have fun and disconnect, which is something that honestly I needed so bad. Tomorrow I'm going on a tour with Airbnb. It's called Highlights of LA. See you guys tomorrow, Wednesday. It's going to be a really cool day. I have something really special planned. Hopefully you will be able to see it. And I'm still waiting for the cold sore to cure. I hope it's cured before Wednesday because, well, I'll explain you later. Goodbye and see you tomorrow. Oh god, this is so awkward. Exactly, <laughs> we're going to Ross. Yes, I don't know Ross. what to expect. Maybe it's <laughs> maybe it's not. Okay, so we are at Ross. We're going to get inside and wish me luck. Exposed <laughs> to the world. Oh god guys, this shop is so weird. There's like no order, like everything is so random. When it opens it's better. But it's like in the morning, yeah. yeah. As makes soon as sense. They open, it's a lot more open, yeah. See you guys in a bit. I'm just gonna stay here. Hello guys, yesterday I forgot to finish the vlog. I was way too tired and I couldn't just sit on film. I just went to sleep straight away. As I told you yesterday, I went on a tour with a couple, Natalie and Javier. They had like an Airbnb experience and they drove us to all the important places and highlights of LA. Okay. And I'm now feeling relieved, amazed, so happy. I laughed, I cried a number of times, I sweat, I danced, I got a shot, I ate, and 
I had many epiphanies. We just were asking them questions all the way and they were really nice. So yeah, overall I think it's worth it. Okay, so today, today I'm going to be a model for a day with a photographer that I have been following for a while and I'm really excited. I mean, I saw her in Airbnb experiences and I was like, oh yeah, she's based in LA. And then like all the dots were connected and I was like, I have to go. I am now going to downtown LA. I'm just gonna explore the zone and then I'm gonna meet her. Her name is Leira Vastorica. I will leave also her Airbnb experience link in the description box in case you want to come here and go on a photoshoot with her. Observe about the lighting. Suddenly it's raining, then it's sunny again. Today I woke up, I got ready. I have been struggling for a while just to decide an outfit for today. I know, first world problems, but I think I like it. I'll show you in a moment. Now I'm leaving, so see you guys in a bit. Hi guys, so we have just finished taking the pictures and it was amazing, Leire was like really professional but I'm so happy, I even changed my outfit because we had two of them We took pictures in this amazing building, is the Disney Auditorium and I'm just gonna return again because I wanna explore it even more, it's stunning I'm kinda tired, I don't know, it's like the whole pressure of being filmed What am I saying? Well, it has been a really cool day, we thought it was going to rain but it didn't. See you guys later. Hello guys, so I've just arrived and I think that now I'm heading out because I'm going to a party. I have been invited by my Brazilian friend, Carol. I don't know what's going to happen, but... Let's go! Hey guys, so I just came back from the party and I actually had a lot of fun. Okay, I run out from memory. By the way, I'm here with my host, Gad. There he is. So as I was saying, I thought that I was going to be alone for real, and I'm not, which is something positive, and I feel really lucky. Like, this whole trip feels like a dream already, so tomorrow I think I'm going to downtown LA again. I still have to see Little Tokyo, and then the cafeteria that later recommended me. So sad, like, I'm just running out, and I'm leaving on Friday, and this has been, like, so short, and I'm just afraid that the vlog looks like a collection of panning shots or whatever. I mean, I don't find it strange because I came here, like, my top priority was getting to know the place and visiting all the touristic places, but at the same time, I just want to share with you how I feel and the things that happened to me. I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm way too tired and I'm way too sleepy. I'm going to sleep now. It's 3 a.m. I just came back from the place. The party was hosted, which was a hostel in Hollywood Boulevard. See you guys tomorrow and... Bye. He just decided to ignore me now. Hey, what's up? Hello guys, today is Thursday and I'm going to the group first and then I'm going to downtown LA again. I'll be going to a few museums and exploring what's left of Los Angeles, or at least for me. Today is going to be my last full day here and I'm like, where has the time gone? I'm feeling slightly sad because I know that when I come back to Baltimore I'll have to work my butt off and finish everything for me. And I want to come back soon, to be honest. I don't know if I will have the chance because from London to here is like different. I'm now going to the groove. I'll probably have breakfast there. I'll carry you with me, so you'll see it. Yeah, see you guys in a bit.
I bought this and they have never eaten one of these and she's wondering if she can eat like this part. Like Can I? Okay guys, so I've just arrived in the Airbnb. It's time for an emotional speech. I'm just kidding. I'm just gonna make it as short as possible. I'm just gonna share my thoughts. I leave Spain, I say goodbye to everyone I know in Spain. I go to the UK, then I leave the UK, say goodbye again. I go to Baltimore and I'll probably have to say goodbye pretty soon as well. And then it goes on and on and on and... It never ends, actually. I'll just have to get used to it. The truth is that I live things pretty intensely and that I sometimes struggle with my emotions, especially with the ones related to the passing of time, saying goodbye, as I said. Yeah, it's time to work again. And there's something that tells me that I'll be coming back to the US in the near future. I don't know why. I just have loved LA and I dare to say maybe that I'd like to live here for some time in the future. We don't know yet. I don't want to make this longer. Now I'm gonna pack my things because I have the checkout early tomorrow and I'm gonna plan what I'm going to do tomorrow before the flight because I'm flying at 10 p.m. so I got plenty of time. The thing is that I have to look for a place to leave my luggage because I'm carrying a carry-on bag and I kinda don't want to be dragging it all around tomorrow. I'm just worried about the health of the cat. Thank you guys for sticking around. Tomorrow will probably be the last day of the vlog. Then I'm gonna wrap it up, edit it. I don't know when am I going to be able to upload it, but I hope soon. Although I think that's not going to happen because it takes me ages to edit vlogs, like ages. But well, see you guys tomorrow, my last day of my Los Angeles adventure, and bye! It's almost 12, I gotta leave the Airbnb. I'm not gonna say again that I'm sad, because I have said it like 500 times, but yes. It's uh, been quite a journey, and yeah, it's time to leave. Look, look. Why you talking in code, no reason? Why you got me on hold, I'm beeping? I knew something was ignited When you left I wanted more All I wanna do is get to know you East to west to north to south the whole you Okay, so I have decided to come to the Hollywood Forever Cemetery And it's a really beautiful place The weather is so perfect, there's a lot of sun It has like the tallest palm trees I have ever seen Yeah, it's really nice if you just like walk around stuff There's even like People taking pictures ahead of me. I'm in such a busy direction. You get the message. Now don't you hit me with a rain check. I need something like a blank check. Spending a lot of emotion on tonight. Don't you hit me with a rain check. No need to make it a train wreck. Find me a time and decide it soon. Cause I'll be on my way. But I don't wanna wait. My time is of the essence, don't you know? If you give me a day, believe